Hi. I'm going to be doing a video of a book review on the book Sadie by Courtney Summers. I hope you enjoy. I'm going to be basically like reviewing it, you know, how reviewing, what reviewing means. And I'm going to show you the book and what I like about it, what I didn't like about it, you know, all that kind of stuff. So I hope you enjoy this video. It's one of my first. I hope you subscribe, follow on social medias or whatever. I hope you enjoy. I'm sorry I will not be showing my face because, well, of issues. But I do hope you enjoy. Excuse the dirty ass mirror. <laughs> Either way, thank you. Bye. Okay, I'm back with the actual book. As you can see, it's Sadie by Courtney Summers. It's kind of like an aesthetic uh, white book, covered book. It's actually a really, it's a, ni it's a nice book. What drew me to this book exactly was the fact it's a kind of a popular murder mystery type of book. And people seem to really like it, so I bought it. Un like not really knowing what it was all about other than something about the the main character's sister being murdered and she's on a mission to um what is it to ke to to do away with the killer I mean but I mean the thing about this book is um let me see It's got, it's like a, po it's like, some parts are in the form of a podcast, as you can see, kind of like a script type thing. And then, and others, in other parts, it's like, actual, the actual character speaking on her experiences, while the podcast, the podcast is like, sort of, um, sort of a, uh, awkward. <laughs> It's sort of like, um, in the future, like after the girl has gone through all the, her experiences and stuff. So, I mean, it's kind of, it's, it's a difficult book to follow at first, but once you actually get into it, I mean, it's not that bad, but I wasn't like such a um, huge, huge fan because, well, I like Pacific, like, I'm like a different kind of, I guess, reader. I like mostly fantasy type dra to, uh, stuff, but yeah, it's one of those books that I'm not a huge fan of, but I'm also not like hating on it or anything. So I recommend this for anybody who's into like young adult mysteries or uh, contemporary or whatever because it's not a bad book. As you can see I have like tons of other books in the book over there. But um, yeah, it's one of my different kind of genre books. But I hope, but I mean, if you like it, it's good for you. I mean, go for it. Read it. I mean, I recommend it for anybody who's interested or who's been wanting to read it for a while but yeah anyway I I, 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 I don't know I can speak today but anyway if you want to see this like read it you can buy it on Amazon or Barnes and Nobles or really any place where it sells books. I don't recommend Walmart because I don't think you'll find it there. But yeah, see I've got another book over there. It's The Hate You Give that I'm starting to read. I had just recently read this book so I finished it like a couple days ago. It was like my last read of 2018 and like my uh, sort of first read of 2019 but I mean I wanted to move on to the other books that I have over there. See, so you can see Queen of Air and Darkness over there, and uh, Wind Rider by PC Cast, and then you can see it all like 
I've read all those other books, so. But yeah. If you want to read this, you can find it at most places that sell books. I do recommend it as it is a is it's a pretty good book. The story is really good. So I hope you enjoy. I mean, I hope you enjoyed this video because <laughs> I kind of suck. But this is like one of my first. I sorry about not showing my face. I just have my reasons. But yes, as you can see, there's a whole bunch of stuff over there. But yeah, I hope you like.